So how many is that? One, two, three, four, five. That's six? There's, there's only five that I see there, but yeah, it should be six. <clears throat> Maybe it doesn't show up until the statue is broken. We'll count them. Or maybe it does, but it just didn't make it sound known. Maybe it'll be there now. Nope. No, they're all gone. Everyone's gone. Even uh, Neo and whatever that woman's name is, and the Dalek, and Ron Weasley, and Lassie. <laughs> not that. Not that. Over there. Not that Neo. Not that Neo. <laughs> Lassie. Oh no, the Pee Wee traps. Ah! That's actually a scarily good Pee Wee Herman impersonation. Yeah. No, I, I, I can't do Pee Wee Herman. Ha <laughs> ha. I can't do it. Since used to be really good at it. Actually, probably still is, but. What do I pay my bouncers for? Standing around looking at the women? It's magic. And that is the job in every video he's in. That's three, four, yeah, that's six. Excellent. Six down. What, ten to go? Yes, come on, Smithers, let's go. Why? Why am I Smithers? I don't know why, why would you not be Smithers? You love Malibu, Stacey. No, I don't. <laughs> I get you. <laughs> I forgot that Smithers lost Malibu Stacey. He loves him. Love I also forgot Malibu. that he had that creepy um, computer boot up screen of Mr. Burns naked. Really? Yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure it was that same episode. Or it may have been a different episode, I can't remember. There's an episode where uh, Bart and Lisa are with, with Smithers and he boots up his computer and it's like a, a digitised thing of Mr. Burns hugging himself naked and he goes, uh, oh hello Smithers, you really know how to turn me off. Oh yeah, yeah. I, think <laughs> I, I think I remember that now. Super creepy, especially when he's showing that to children. Yeah, and it's Mr. I'm Burns. Just, I'm just walking, I've no idea where I'm actually supposed to be going. These boots are but made for me. walking. Yeah, the boots will walk all over you. Damn it. Come on! Go agro! Yeah, I forgot. You see like big lights going up into the sky like the end of a superhero film. And that's where all the Colossus that have killed all. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You notice that like every superhero film in like the last 10 years. Has to end with like a big light shooting up into the sky. It's in the description. It all started with Avengers. I don't remember anyone doing it before Avengers. To get the portal open? Yeah. yeah. But since then, it's like Suicide Squad, Justice League. I don't remember if Batman v Superman done it. They all have to have a light shooting up in the sky. I think Ghostbusters done it. I must say that the game, for being an upscaled PlayStation 4 game, looks really good. Eh, uh, PlayStation 2 game. Oh yeah, I mean, I like... I think the PS3 game was just an upscaled version of the PS2 game, but I'm pretty sure this was built from the ground up. Like, because a lot of this, like the stamina bar and everything's route is completely different on this than it is from the earlier games. How important does it used to be? It used to just be like a pink circle. Oh, like right. You didn't have that line extending across it. To give you that little bit extra. Yeah, to, to let you know that... Uh, it give you more of a scale of how much your stamina's growing. Oh, yeah, because you get, like, as long as it the, falls all the way out, that you know that you've got everything. Yeah, the li well, the line grows longer the more stamina that you get. Yep. So it gives you sort of sense of how big your stamina bar's growing compared to when you started the game. But the original one is just like a, a pink circle. Ah, lizard! Get off the horse! Silly boy. Enough with the horse! So then the Hercules. Oh, like, right, uh, yeah. they, they try to freeze the horse and it gets Hades, and then they try to use molten lava and it goes there and he's like, Enough with the horse! <laughs> I love James Woods. That lizard is just clipping in and out of that mountain. Kill.
I still think one of my... Oh! One of my favourite jokes. And you knew Disney film was in Hercules when all the Titans were walking towards Mount Olympus and they're like, Kill Zeus! And Hades is like, um, um, guys, Mount Olympus is that way. And they'll just sort of slowly turn around and go, Kill Zeus! Yeah, that's one of my favourite bits as well. I love yeah. that. I think Hercules is probably one of my favourite Disney films though. It's a good one. Yeah, it's really good. And I think it came out when we were old enough to go to the pictures to see it. Yeah. Like in terms of like... I'm vaguely... Yeah. Like the, the Little Mermaid was released in the late 80s so... Yeah. I know I know it did come back out in cinemas but for, for us it was released like way too young. Yeah. Where'd you go? Where'd you go, Lizard? Pass. I've seen two. I've seen another one. I'll have a wee. I'll have a little look. Ah, where'd the horse. Where are you going? Who scared my horse? Bad horse. I'll have a little look. If it doesn't show up, I'll just leave him. I'll leave him to mourn over the corpse, corpse of his dead lover. Yeah, but we just. Um. Come on, horse. Ah, there's one. Can you not just like whistle? He's come to you. What, the horse? Yeah. Yeah. Fresh triangle when he says his name. There you go then. And you love me, but you hate me, but I love you, but you hate me. What? And you love me, but I don't know why. <laughs> I like how many rhymes like really ingenious words together, like Kodak and Kodak. <laughs> Who do you know? <laughs> <laughs> Don't <I> shoot! <laughs> oh wait. Oh. So the arrow right through the chest. <laughs> I love his little like leg kick. It looks like bloody up. the Super Mario long jump. Yahoo! <laughs> Every single time. It's a me. Wario. I was gonna say that sounded more like Waluigi. <laughs> <laughs> Waluigi like the worst AI of those. Yeah. I don't I don't know if Wario and Waluigi are related. I don't think they ever really went into detail. I don't think Nintendo cared enough. That's unusual because he's. There was, there was, like, did you know Gaming done a video all about Waluigi recently where they talked about, like, his history and how his name isn't just, just a shitty play on Luigi? Like, it actually does mean something. I think, I think it ends up translating to, like, bad Luigi. I'm pretty certain that that's the case as well. Um, I'm just trying to think. Like. Oh, there's definitely lizards on this uh, temple thing. <laughs> If I remember correctly, I, I, I often don't. We'll see. Well, I think I've went entirely wrong way. Well, use your, use your thing. No, it's it's over this way, but I think I need to go around the other side of that wall. Alright, okay. Damn Trump building walls to the <laughs> cross out. <laughs> we have to keep the wanders out. Coming over here, resurrecting our women. Killing our colossi. Well, I've eaten our lizard tails. If they were a real thing, like they would be weaponized in a second. Oh. And I'm oh. so sad. I can't remember this towards that. Uh, Lost blowfish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad. Remember nine four when now I was, was big. What I chose. With my band. That's a little fish. <laughs> now nobody wants to hold my hand. I'm not retired. retired. I, I just, just got hired. Man, that was terrible. That's come from me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, John Ryan. I'm uh, I'm gonna have to let you go. Ideally, we would like somebody that's good at <laughs> music. That <laughs> <laughs> was a blowfish. I said, Daddy. Yeah. I'm, I don't even know who John Ryan is. But he must have the same reputation as uh, Dave Matthews. <laughs> mm, maybe. 
Um, wait. No, come on. <laughs> what are you trying to do that horse? Uh, okay, so I'm trying to see. I need to go... I think I need to go through those clouds and up and pass to the other side of the wall. To the wall? I remember spending ages the last time trying to get over that wall before I realised I couldn't get over it and I had to go around it. <coughs> yeah. You got to go around it. That is a dead end. I don't know if it is. Come on, horse. Stop slowing down just because there's rocks in your way. How so very dare you, horse. Yeah, I think I think this is the way. Come on. Wizards. Oh, it's fine. I don't think I've got enough for just now. Yeah, just to get you through. Did, did the close I get a wee bit harder as we go along? Um, no, not just really. Just can't stay at the same level. Well, some are harder, some are easier. I think I, I think a lot. Less it depends on the Colossus and like themselves, and depends on like their move pattern and whether. Whether they do what you need them to do. Like yeah. that, that last one that we fought, I could have spent ages trying to get him to bend down so I could grab his beard. Yeah. But that time he just happened to have done it straight away. And then you managed to grab his beard. Yeah. Whereas, you know, there's ones, like I said, the horse one that you can spend forever trying to get him into position. And he just won't do it. Yeah, you were lucky that time, though, the last time. Yeah, yeah, he took no time at all. land was before it was sealed off and made it a yeah, colossus graveyard. Hyrule. Oh, this is the water one. It's Hyrule. It's Hyrule. Well, it could oh. be. Some of the things that it looks like a Twilight Princess Hyrule at times. Uh, I never finished that one either. I got up to a section where it was necessary to catch a fish to continue. And you could catch a fish. I catch a fish with the it was I was using the Wiimote oh, and right, I could okay. not catch a fish using that Wii mode. Uh, that's what really annoyed me about the Wii is some of the motion controls you were like, what are you doing? I, I must have spent, I spent about a week on that one section just trying to catch a fish. Yeah. I had to like give a yeti type thing a fish to get past in a new area. Yeah. And I must have spent about a week trying to catch a fish with this Wii mode. Uh, eventually I was just like, I, I can't do this. I'm done! I'm done! It. <laughs> Won't work. Yeah, no, I, I really like Twilight Princess, like, but again... I liked what I played of it. The, just... the motion controls sometimes sucked. Compared to, like, Skyward Sword, which I don't think as good as a game as Twilight Princess, but the motion controls are used a lot better. Because it actually tracks the movement, yeah, it doesn't just react to twitches and twinges. Yeah. It's a catfish. You're a catfish. I am, I'm currently... Catfishing... Very rich Saudi Arabian man. Yeah. So, oh, I thought that was like individual bits of things moving, but it's not, it's the actual fish. Some would say a blowfish. I lost blowfish. What if a catfish ain't really a catfish? It's just a woman pretending to be a catfish. So, when you eventually go down to the water, where's it going to go? Uh, the surface. Uh, come on. You like, can do it! This is the one that... What's that? This is the one that no one would survive. What do you mean, in real life? Yeah. How's that? You're on stone. Yeah, but... You'll see. You will see. Personally, I don't think anyone would be able to do this in real life. If this was real life. What is real life? Um, I don't think the arrow's dead and I think I maybe have to shine my light on it instead. Because the arrow doesn't seem to be penetrating the water. No, it just seems to be just resting on the top and being like, yeah, that's cool, bro. <laughs> you do you, I'll do me. <laughs> <laughs> 